Salutations and good morrow everyone and welcome back to another Grounded Update video where today I'm finally answering one of your guys' most asked questions and that is Sim, which one of the types of damage is going to do the most damage to other things in the game? I.e. is it salty, is it spicy, is it mighty, or is it fresh? Now this does not cover whether or not they take more damage from they say a slashing weapon or a bashing weapon or a stabbing weapon, um, but this will cover each of the different elemental types that has been added to the game in the hot and hazy update before we go any further i got two things to say one a huge shout out to my moderator andrew for going through and putting in a ton of legwork while i was on a little bit of a vacation to get and to finalize every single one of the bugs weaknesses for me so thank you so much and we even have the taze tea and all of the other robot information as well for you guys so i hope that this list is helpful if it is make sure you guys hit that like button make sure you guys leave me a comment down below if you guys found it helpful and also so please don't forget to subscribe and once again huge shout out to Andrew thank you so much my friend it is a wonderful thing to have you with the channel so let's go through and let's talk a couple things first so let's go through the most surprising one for me as you guys know my favorite weapon that's been added to the game is the salt morning star okay and it comes stuck with this salty damage type on it right it automatically does salty damage because it is a salt morning star I as the same as the mint mace will do the fresh damage perk right off the bat right so we have a salty weapon and a fresh damage right off the bat well, let's focus on salty right now so the only bug in the game that takes improved salt damage the bug is technically diving ball spiders okay isn't that kind of crazy that a diving ball spiders are the one thing in the game that takes boosted salt damage i thought that ant lions did until my good friend andrew went through and tested it and really the ant lions don't take bonus damage from salt, and we'll get into what they take bonus damage from in just a moment. But the only other things that take increased salt damage are Tasty, Arkers, and the Assistant Manager. So technically, even though you get this weapon after you fight the Assistant Manager, if you do it properly and you follow through the way that it's supposed to go to get the key card and then to unlock the you know, go through the, the riddle to get the, the key to unlock the chest to get the recipe, you would not actually have this weapon to fight the assistant manager. But if you do, you'll find that this is a bonus type weapon that's going to do even more damage for you. So it's a really, really good weapon for you to use against robots and stuff. Obviously, infected wheels, they are a different story. And also, I do want to add in that this list does exclude grubs, mites, and aphids because you hit them once and they die anyway so you don't really need a boost of damage type okay the next one i want to talk to you guys about is fresh okay fresh damage comes stock on the mint mace that you can get so a really really cool weapon let's see if i actually have it unlocked yet yeah the mint mace it comes fresh stocked with the fresh damage perk this is really awesome it does take mint globs in order to make but this weapon is going to be a bonus to things like stink bugs bees ladybugs infected ladybugs mosquitoes bombardier beetles infected larvae and infected lawn mites all of these things will take bonus damage from the fresh damage type so if you guys are looking for some bonus damage against those enemies use the fresh damage type also i do want to add that every single one of these weaknesses is going to be down in the description for all of you guys to see and also over on my discord for everybody to see as well because i'd hate for you guys to go through this video and be like oh, what was it again i have to go through and search through the video because i just want to help you guys out Okay, so that's fresh damage. So once again, fresh is stink bugs, bees, ladybugs, infected ladybugs, mosquitoes, bombardier beetles, uh, infected larvae, and infected lawn mites. So really, really cool there. The next one I want to go over is where the lion's share of everything is going to be taking damage from, which this is the one that surprised me, and that's mighty. Okay, mighty is what happens when you go through and you just add quartzite globs to your weapons. AKA, these bugs are not yet set up with an actual weapon type weakness. Now, I know that in the future we plan on getting sour candies added to the game, possibly, and maybe some other types of candies as well. So, there always is the possibility for more elements to get added to the game. 
Maybe we're going to be able to infuse charcoal into our game at some point, or into our weapons. Who knows? But right now, they, the enemies that take the most damage from mighty weapons, are going to be as follows. Larvas, red soldier ants, lawn mites, infected gnats, weevils, fireflies, black worker ants, black soldier ants, ant lions, roly polies, meaty gnats, tadpoles, water boatmen, and water fleas. Which is kind of crazy, because that is a huge list of all the things that are in the backyard that are going to be doing a lot of damage to your uh that you're gonna be doing a lot of damage to but the, the craziest thing to me is that you have things like the roly-poly that does not take more damage from anything that's like salty or spicy or fresh it's just mighty damage aka it's looking for just the most amount of damage that you can put out at a time it would help if you guys had some critical from things like um coup de grass and stuff to help them take them out but this large list of things that take damage boost damage from say like a mighty weapon aka just upgrading this mint this uh, assault weapon to do more damage against it is going to boost up everything that you can do. So that's really, really awesome. So a lot of things with Mighty, which leads us to thinking that there's going to be a lot of improvements coming later on in the game to the different damage types and how they're assigned. All right. And the last one that I know a lot of you guys are here to find out and what is left in the game is what takes the most damage from spicy type weapons. And I'm here to tell you it is Red Worker Ants, Wolf Spiders, Orb Weavers, Orb Weaver Juniors, the Spiderlings, and you guessed it, the brood mother she will take more damage from spicy weapons and this is pretty cool a little bit of a tidbit as well as tasty's arkers and assistant manager also take bonus damage from spicy weapons as well which is kind of crazy but yes they do take bonus damage now there are obviously the other damage types in the game that have been in the game already like gas arrows and poison this guide will not cover those but that is crazy to think that all the spider type um bugs in the game and even which was weird the red worker ant which i really wasn't thinking that that's what that was going to be because you'd think that the soldier ant and the worker ant would be the same but they're not now this list obviously is as of the 11.1 .1 update in grounded this list is subject to change whenever they update the game but this is as of the most recent update that we have to the game so once again, I'll go over the list. Spicy is Red Worker Ants, Wolf Spiders, Orb Weavers, Orb Weaver Juniors, Spiderlings, The Broodmother, Taze Tees, Arkers, and The Assistant Managers. Okay? Stink Bugs and Bees, Ladybugs, Infected uh, infected Ladybugs, Mosquitoes, Bombardier Beetles, uh, Infected Larva, and Lawn Mites all take more damage from Fresh. And the Mighty Damage Perk is going to give you bonus damage to Larvas, Red Soldier Ants, Lawn Mites, Infected Gnats, Weevils, Fireflies, Black Worker Ants, Black Soldier Ants, Ant Lions, Roly Polies, Meaty Gnats, Tadpoles, Water Boatmen, and Water Fleas. And lastly, the Salty Damage is going to do bonus damage to Diving Ball Spiders, Taze Tees, Arkers, and and assistant managers as well but there is one more thing that i forgot to leave out for all of you guys and that is the infected weevil the infected weevil will take bonus damage from every single element except for mighty isn't that weird that there's one thing out there that takes a little bit less damage from other things but that is the complete list now i do know that me and my team are currently working on different damage types from different types of weapons from bashing slashing and piercing weapons to see which bug types will take more damage from those and we are also working on a strengths so which uh, different types of bugs and enemies in the backyard are stronger to different types of damage now It could be that these are opposites I'm not sure but we're gonna have to go through and do some testing So make sure you guys subscribed turn that bell notification to all so that way when that video comes out You guys don't miss it also leave me a comment down below if you guys have found any other types of bugs that are weak to other things Because like I said this was a lot of legwork put in by not only myself but also a really good mod of mine Andrew um, so this is just our take and what we have found now this is extensive testing so it's true and good but if you guys have found something else in your guys's videos or your guys's game through gameplay let me know down in the comments and also please don't forget to hit that like button and as always i'll see all of you guys in the next one